everybody. Today we're going to try Big Red. Uh, it's a brand that's, uh, I'm not, who's, I've never been certain as to who they were associated with. Okay, bottled under the authority of Big Red Incorporated, Austin, Texas. So they've given permission to somebody in the area to bottle Big Red for them. As well as keep their uh, formula a secret. And there's something going on here. It's a barbecue across America. Some kind of promotional here for, uh, let's see, win a whole mess of summer barbecue prizes. Ah, I see. Obviously there's going to be uh, some kind of texting, some kind of snapping of a picture, something else. But, uh, well, you have to find out the details on your own bottle. But here we are, Big Red. And we'll open it up. We're just making sure it's been through a little bit of a rough ride. And so we'll pour. There we go with half the glass. And naturally, I'm going to have to put this back on because I didn't go over the nutrition facts. And here we go. It says, serving size 12 flowing ounces, servings per container about 5, calories 150, total fat 0 grams, sodium 30 milligrams, total carbohydrates 38 grams, sugar 38 grams, and protein 0 grams. And there you go. It doesn't have the four vitamins and minerals. Once again, big red. All right. Let's gra grab that uh, glass once again. Obviously, even though we had a uh, clear bottle, it's we're going to use the glass. And it's uh, reddish in coloration. We'll get ready for that whiff test. Get all that bad air out of the lungs. Okay, here we go. Yep. It smells like Big Red, but I don't remember what it's supposed to be like. It's, um... Cotton candy or something like that? I don't believe they've ever had... a, uh, specific flavor or coloration. Let's see here. Nope. It's just all, uh, natural and artificial ingredients. And no designated, uh, no designated flavor or taste to it, or what have you. It's just, uh, Big Red. It's not cherry, it's not strawberry. Maybe if it was, uh, artificially engaged, it might be considered strawberry. But let's go for that taste. Yeah, I'd say, yeah. I'd hazard a guess it is strawberry, even though I've, you know, it's rare that I've ever had this over the years. But, it's very good. I'll give it a thumbs up. There's a bit of a, a strange aftertaste. It's probably associated with the carbonated water, but, uh, you know. That's just the way it goes, you know, as, as you get older, your taste buds change on you. Hmm. Empty glass. All right. Once again, big red. And that's it for this video. Like and subscribe, share with your friends, and I'll see you next time. Take care.